This is a story I heard from a friend. So I'll leave judgment of its veracity up to you. The friend is a woman, an office worker. Quite diligent, she often worked overtime apparently. Not a huge company, but overtime pay was provided. One day, she was asked to make a large number of copies and stayed late to finish them. The copier at this company was rather old, scanning and copying documents directly, it seems. After placing the last document and starting the copy job, she went to the locker room to gather her things to leave. After getting ready to go, she returned to the copier, where solid black sheets of paper were being printed out. Looking at the output, it started as black dots that gradually expanded wider. Puzzled, opening the copier, Lid revealed a document stained completely red inside. Despite her unease, she picked up the paper. There a smashed woman's face was plastered against the glass surface. Terrified, she ran straight home it was close to the office. At least convincing herself, it was a dream. Or, I imagined it, she drank and slept that night. The next day, having regained composure, she went to the office early to tidy up the mess and dispose of the disturbing copy before it was found. While still frightened, she didn't believe in such things. So had convinced herself it was in her head. Approaching the copier, the lid was still open. Documents strewn about just like the night before. Warily peeking inside, there was nothing there. Copies printed normally and documents weren't stained red. Thinking it must have been fatigue-induced hallucinations. She gathered the originals. After organizing the copies, as she thought. What was that about? Glancing at the copier, one sheet had fallen under the machine. Picking it up absent-mindedly, the woman's smashed face from the previous night was printed on it.